Hello guys, welcome back to MMORPG Tycoon 2. So today we're starting right in, uh, right in the game. I haven't messed around with anything yet, so let's just go right in. Now what we wanted to do is flesh out this area, which we're going to do once we get some more money. But what I wanted to do real quick was... Uh, just thank the last person on one of my videos that left a comment, which was, I believe it was Shiruzen. Let me just double check here really quickly. Ding, ding, ding. Yeah, it indeed was Shiruzen. Thank you for your support and your comments. Um, I do try to uh, make the videos as fun as possible since I'm having fun and you know, I want you guys to have fun. So thank you for commenting on all my videos and sticking with me all this time. I really appreciate it. I know that you could be watching some other big YouTuber but you've decided to come watch me. That's awesome. So thank you for that. And in your honor, since... Uh, you were so kind as to leave comments on every single video. I am actually going to make you an NPC. Now, I don't know which one you would want to be, or if you want to be a, an elite or anything, but what I'm going to do is I'm going to make you a guard for now. I'm going to make you a high elf guard. I'll, make you, I'll put you over here. So let's put you up here for this area. So you'll be in, you'll be in this area once we start building it. So I'll put you down there. There we go. Let's name this guy. There we go. You are now in the game as a guard. And I thank you for that. There we go. Oh, interesting. Never actually saw what this was. Um, yeah, so thank you again. Keep up commenting and Hopefully you keep enjoying. As of now, what we'll do is we'll skip forward uh, until we have about maybe uh, 10,000 pounds. Give us a bit, bit to play around with. So I will see you guys in a second. And we are back. Awesome. That is, that's great. So now we've got some money. Um, so let's start fleshing out the area we were going to build, which was down here. Now, I did say I was going to put some walls. So, buildings. Can't remember where it was. Was it buildings? Oh, yes. This is landmarks. That's not what I wanted. Oh, here it is. Paths. So, let's have a look at this, shall we? So, let's put in... How about this? How about this one? Why not? Do that, and then snap towards distance snap. Leave that like so, and now we've got a little, nice little area. Now I did actually want to have the, the, the entrance up here, but this works fine actually. This works better than I thought. It's a mountain path, we need this one. So what we'll do is we'll do it like this and then we'll connect it there we go so we now we've got a path so now we want this path to kind of come around like so down to here there we go let's get some buildings get the scenery get the lighthouse i may have put in that in the wrong way yes Let's move this really quickly, so. Needs to be like so. There we go. Very nice. Put in the path again just to connect it a little bit. Can I not? No, apparently not. Okay, so that's fine like that. We'll get some more buildings, so let's put a respawn point in here. 
Let's just get the elegant one again, why not? So there we go. And we need a potion shop. Do we not have any elegant ones? Oh, let's get the coastal ones. Perfection. Go postal. Then we got can actually put these like this. There's a guess civilized shop just because it looks kind of cute next to that. Then we'll get a. I don't think we need anything else. Postal shop. And then we need the inn. Come on, tavern. I mean, rather. So we got the coastal one, yep. Looks very nice, wow. Put it there, because that looks really nice. There we go, now we go back to buildings and we'll put a in. Can actually put this at the end of this road, like so. That looks really nice. So now we've got this little area. So what we'll do is we shall put in some <laughs> respawn point, starting point. We've got the shops, got the town, got the inn. Now, do we want these ones? Let's get these ones actually. Yeah, why not? Let's just have kind of place this here and then I'll kind of change the doors and whatnot. No? What happened there? Got no clue what happened there. some more onto it on this side because why not there we go that looks nice there have that in there Let's go into some scenery We'll get a nice little fountain again over here, maybe. Let's put that there. That's probably kind of in the ground now, isn't it? Yeah, that's fine for now. That's okay. But what we need to do first is we need to get a network in here. So the network connection needs to come in here. Let's take this off here. Like so. Okay. Now we've run out of money already. Wow, that's uh, that's gone really quick, hasn't it? We haven't even got any NPCs in here yet. But that's fine. So let's just fast forward a bit more, get some more money, and we'll be back in a second, guys. I think that's more than enough for now, isn't it? So let's get some NPCs in here, guys. Let's uh, get some quest givers. Let's actually get some guards first. Let's put some guards here. Put sages. Go. Put some quest givers now. We want some sages down here. We want a scout down here because why not? And then we want a high elf. Now this high elf will, but will end up taking us to Shiuzan later on. Okay, guys. So this guy is Shiuzan's friend, maybe his friend. Why not? That's his friend. Okay. So let's do that. Let's leave this guy here. I actually have the perfect name for this guy. If you guys don't know who this guy is, then really, please, go check him out. He's awesome. There we go. So now we've got two guys here. We've got some guards. Now let's get some trainers in here, because we might need them anyway. So they will put them... Kind of here. Here and here. So, now, we need a quest to bring people to this area. So what we'll do is we'll go all the way down here. This guy has 
all his quests taken. Ah. Did not think this one through, did I? What about this guy? He has as well. Right, let's make another quest giver. Pause the game for now. We'll make this high elf. Okay. This guy. Will actually take us all the way over to talk to Geek Pipe. And then this guy, this quest, will take us over to uh, this guy. Okay. Now this guy, Geek Bite, will then also discover the sausage. That's awesome. We'll leave that for now. So this guy will also take us to this NPC. But he will also take us to the inn. As well as the tavern. Okay. Now this guy will do those two normal quests. But he will also take us to the landmark. He will also take us to the potion shop. He will also take us to the normal shop. Okay, so there we have it. So now we have quests that will take us from one area to this area and then the guys in this area will do all their, th do their thing and blah blah blah, right? So that's perfect. So that's fine. What we'll do is we'll give this guy the quest already which is this one to go to Shoes then, who is up here. Like so. Locate the princess. Perfection, because it goes in the con in connection with the book, because we're looking for it. Okay, so, awesome, great. S little spoiler there, sorry guys. If you haven't read the book, please go read it. But what we'll do now, for now, is he hasn't got any quests because he's a guard, which is fine. We're gonna have to change that. Uh, I think, actually. So let's actually delete this guy. We just lost money. But that's fine. See how now? He's a quest giver, so that's fine. He's going all the way over there. And then discovering his shoes. Wow. That's, uh... Come on, geek bite. Can I not? There we are, geek bite. He had a quest which we deleted because. All right, he can go to Shiuzan. There we go. Now Shiuzan has a quest that goes here. Awesome. Now, let's make a road that goes along this whole area down here. That then ends up going this way. But then one that also kind of redirects to here, like so. Okay, let's put in the mountain pass because why not? We'll end, up, we'll end up messing around with that later on. That's fine. So, awesome. We've done this. We'll flesh this out in a minute. So, we still need to flesh out this area as well, actually. So, let's just continue with this area and then we'll see what else we can do. So, let's get some more modular buildings. Let's build like a like a castle in here, why not? It's gonna tell us there's too many bricks in a minute, isn't it? Honestly, would not be surprised if it told us that in any second now. Yep, now it's too big. Awesome. So that's actually nice. We'll have that in there. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Grid snap. Nice. Actually perfect. There we go. We got no money left. Wow, that went quick. <laughs> Always seems to go really quick in this game, doesn't it? We we think we need more money, don't we? We think, we think, we think, we think. Now, why not cut it? This services, real money. That still costs real money. So we've got two users because people are paying real money. Awesome. Now, 
I really like this little area. It's become really kind of nice as well as this one. The level one area, honestly, to me, is amazing. I love the level one area. The level two area just seems very, seems very bland, doesn't it? So let's see if we can actually fix that a bit. Swamp, pine forest, desert. Can't really become any more desert than this, can it? Yeah, see, it's not doing anything, is it? So. Do not want to do this area, actually. Let's fix that. It's actually fixed that part. Very nice. That looks very nice now, actually. Do you know what? Let's just do this horror area as well. What we need to do is we need to get rid of this. In the water. We don't really want trees in the water, do we? There we go. Yeah. Now we've got cactus cacti in the water, but that's better than nothing, I think. Um Let's have a look at reports. Levels. Two hundred and four people level two. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Finances are slowly going up, as you can see, it's uh, slowly going up. Very good. Rating. Six negative buzz. I wonder why. I wonder how we can fix this. Couldn't find an inn with free, free spaces. That could be our concern. Yeah, so people need inns down here. There's not many inns, huh? Is there even one here? Where is it? Is it this one? Then this is the inn, isn't it? So let's just build more. Now I can't afford again. Wow, oh, I run out of money so fast on this game. So that's that. So considering I keep running out of money, I think we've done pretty well in this area. So that's nice. Just thinking what else we could do. Hmm. I think guys let's let it run for a bit accumulate some money or well, a lot of money because we need I reckon 10,000 is a good amount but to flesh out the level 2 area a bit more let's, let's aim for about 30 or 40,000 so I will be back once we get that much money um, why don't you guys go get a drink as well, pause the game if you want to, and we'll be back in a second. We are back, we apparently won an award. Best visuals. Noise. V noise. That is awesome. Alright, anyway guys, we'll be right back with more money. And we're back guys, as you can see, we have accumulated £50,000. Whew, that was a... Ball ache and a half, really, getting all that. That's taking us about five minutes. Well, I mean, for you, it's taking literally a second. So, noise. Um, as you can see, we've got loads of subscribers now. Still no level three people, because there's no level three areas, actually. So now, what we'll do is, we'll make some more level two areas. Uh, we'll flesh this area out a little bit. Now that we've got more monsters. So let's add some more in here. So now we've got more money, rather go get some around here as well now why not 
Okay, and then pretty much the whole coastal area. I just want to have crocodiles because why not, guys? Why not? There's nothing stopping us from doing that. So that's awesome. There we go. Now we will add some high level monsters here. Why the hell not? There we go. Got some high levels in here as well. Go. And these are spiders, aren't they? Yes. Do we have any more skeletons here? There we go. These little areas can actually have an alighten as well. Why not? There we go. And we've got the cobalts. There we go. Awesome. Nice, nice, nice. So let's get some more quest givers. Let's put some on this on this uh, side. Oop. So what we'll start doing is we'll put sages around this area. So there's more sages here. This guy can have some quests: crocodiles, spiders, skeletons, skeletons, skeletons. Sure, why not? Um, crocodiles, skeletons. No. Let's do this because actually that one's fine. This guy. That one's fine. This one. This one go in here. Speeders. Yeah, and I really want to do that. Let's go on this one. There we go, that's fine. And then we'll get some Got another quest giver in here who takes us to uh get rid of this one. So he takes us to He's taking us here anyway. Actually, yeah, no, no problem. He can also come here, why not? And then So Bring me a sausage, really? Guys, come on. Okay, there we go. Very good. We need more quests to push people up this way. So I think right now we've only got a few. So I add another quest giver in here. Let's add a. Let's add an high elf in here, shall we? Is it Lady Allen, really? Okay then. This guy also takes you to Geek Bite, right all over here. And this one takes you to this guy. I think that's that's I think that's a pretty good idea. Okay, so let's flesh this out a little bit more, make it nice and pretty. Buildings. We want more buildings in here, guys. Why not, right? It's a bit odd. That's just going rid of that, and I didn't want to do that. Bummer. It's fine. It's fine. Let's get some scenery. Let's put one back. Um, let's put a few in here. Why not? It's actually kind of funny that you can place them pretty much anywhere you want. But actually, it looks kind of cool like that. So now we flesh this area out. That's fine. We'll leave that how it is. Let's go all the way over here. 
Let's see if we can put some more trees in here because this is backing trees. Oh, this is going really crazy, huh? Because honestly, I don't really want to build too much in this area because I just want people to come here just to get a quest and then move on. That's all I wanted. And that is basically what has happened. So now people go there, get quests. Awesome, guys. Right. So let's maybe flesh, let's maybe expand this area, these, uh, these skeletons. Why not? Put them all the way up here. Let's just merge all these. You know what? Let's just merge these. There we go. Oh god, that's a perfect timing to start saving game. Let's do this. Cutting into the crocodiles, but that's fine. There we go. Like so. Not what I wanted to do. They're crowded, so that's awesome. Very good. Monster death, a player death. Okay, good. That's awesome. That's what I wanted. Now the crocodiles, we don't really want them overpopulated, which is fine how they are now. Because if you if you end up getting too many of them, then not a very good idea. Okay, so we've got this area fleshed out. We've got sheaves and all the way alone, all the PA all alone. Let's put some buildings where he is. Just to make him feel more at home. Just small in. It's not very really small, but okay. I'll take it. Get a tavern as well, just for him. Let's get a sylvan tavern, why not? Kind of multicultural area here, which why not? Get some shops. Um, potion shop? Yeah, let's get a potion shop, why not? Um, let's get the sylvan one. That seems fine to me. So she then has a little area. We'll give him some friends. Give him two guards. One here and one here. Could get some more quest givers. Because why the hell not? You can never have too many quest givers. And need some trainers everywhere. So, very good. Now you've got all these quest givers. Now she's then is then gonna end up taking us all the way up here to the guard here. No spawn point in region. Ah, uh, yeah, right. Good point. And then we'll do Sylvan respawn point. Let's put one Richie right here. Put some NPCs. Now, it won't be that bad because people won't be going into that area until they're that level anyway. So there we go. So let's put this until all the way here. You go here. And he will also go to the respawn point. Which apparently isn't working because I think we need to, re I think we need to build a network first. <laughs> which kind of makes sense. So, anyways, guys, I think that'll be it for this video. We fleshed out this area. Oh, let's get off this. There we go. So we fleshed out the area. We built what we said we would. Uh, we've added more quests. Well, there's shed load quests here, which hopefully will make people more aware. Um, but actually, what we'll do is, and I say that, we need more bandwidth anyway. What we'll do is 
It's actually like a flight path to here, but we'll also make a flight path to here. Can't afford it, really. One second, let's just do this real quick. All right. And we need more bandwidth now. We've run out of bandwidth, apparently. Seems we have run out, so let's do that real quick. Let's fix that issue. Fast forward a bit more. I'll be right back. Right, let's see if we can fix this issue. Let's get another uplink in here. Let's put one there. Hopefully that fixes it all. Yep, that has fixed that issue. Oh god, that was uh, that was a bit dangerous. Anyway, guys, I will uh, leave it there. We got pretty far today. That's awesome. Uh, we we did a good job there. And as always, thank you all for watching. I hope you all stay safe and take care. And I look forward to seeing you all in the next video. So until then, bye bye.